Elephants are some of the biggest and most majestic animals in the world. They're also very social animals and depend on one another for company. Sometimes they might need help. That's where humans come in. Here is a collection of elephant rescue stories. Elephant rescue near the Earl Anthony River. Elephants have always been a precious animal in India, but now they are also listed as an endangered species. Though they are smaller on the Asian continent than their African cousins, they are not to be underestimated. Whenever an elephant in India gets into trouble and people try to help them, they do whatever they can to save the animal. That is what happened when a little elephant found himself in a difficult time. No resources or time were spared so he could be rescued. The dramatic scene took place next to the Earl Anthony River in central Taika. The calf was trying to cross the river with its herd when it had the worst luck and fell into an abandoned man-made well. The poor animal was crying as it tried over and over again to climb out of the hole. The well was very deep and if left there, the elephant would surely not survive. Luckily, nearby villagers and forest officials heard its crying and quickly came to its rescue. The forest officials immediately commenced a rescue operation and brought an excavator to the scene. That their intention was to dig out the dirt around the well in order to build a ramp-like structure so the elephant could simply walk out on its own. As the rescue operation got underway, a crowd of people gathered around to watch. The herd of elephants were also nearby. They were anxiously waiting in the river for the baby elephant to safely return. The operator of the excavator carefully dug out the dirt bit by bit. He had to be very careful to not harm the elephant while digging. The calf stayed calm during the rescue and cooperated very well. It even moved to the other side of the hole as the excavator got closer to clearing the path. It was as if the young calf understood that the people were trying to help him. When the ramp was high enough, the little elephant could finally climb out on its own. It immediately ran down the river. The herd quickly ran through the river to be reunited with the calf. The adult elephants were extremely happy to see their lost family member and trumpeted in excitement. They surrounded and touched the calf as if they're comforting him and checking to see if he was doing all right. After all, he had been stuck in the hole for a very long time. The spectators and rescuers witnessed the joyous reunion and joined in with mutual happy cheers. When the elephants had made sure that baby was okay and were about to leave the scene, one of the elephants did something out of the blue and truly amazing. The huge animal turned around facing the crowd of people and lifted his trunk upwards and waved at them. It looked as if the animal was thanking the rescuers. The crowd screamed in delight at this incredible humble gesture. Many of the spectators believed that it was probably the mother of the calf who was showing her appreciation to the humans who had helped save her baby. Although it's not uncommon for elephants to show their emotions towards humans, the act was totally unexpected. As these weren't elephants that were raised in captivity, but real wild elephants. While many experts are not sure if the elephant was actually thanking the rescuers or not, the footage is just an amazing thing to see. Sometimes it only takes the heart to understand certain things and I believe this kind act was one of them. The rescue operation lasted over five hours, but in the end, it was well worth the time, effort, and resources. The baby elephant had successfully been rescued and also happily reunited with herd. And thankfully, we have it all on video to remind us of how connected humans and animals really are. For the following story, Willie making a trip to South Africa where the cousins of the Asian elephants live. It seems baby elephants all over the world get into trouble. Also, if you've not done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these animal stories every day. Now, back to the story. The Rescue at Adido Elephant National Park The Adido Elephant National Park is a conservation park situated close to Fort Elizabeth in South Africa. It is one of the 20 national parks in the country, and in fact, it is the third biggest one with a wide range of biodiversity, incredible landscapes, and stunning flora and fauna. The park is home to all kinds of wildlife, including over 600 elephants. It is an amazing place to view these majestic giants freely roaming around on the park's premises of 630 square miles. The group of elephants at the park consists of several families and like in most families, the younger members tend to run into trouble much easier. There have been a number of successful elephant rescues in the park, but sometimes they don't understand what the rangers are doing and need to communicate more clearly. This story is about one such rescue. 
One day, a baby elephant was at a watering hole with its family. I'm not sure how it happened, but the young calf fell into the water. He tried his best to climb out, but was struggling really bad. The edge of the dam was simply too high for the small creature to climb over. I'm pretty sure the poor thing was scared and probably calling out for its mother. As I stated in the beginning, elephants are social beings who look out for each other. So of course, the herd naturally did what they would have done for any other baby elephant in their family. To save a baby elephant that had fallen into a watering hole, a herd of elephants gathered on this side of the watering hole and tried to break the rock-hard embankment. They wanted to make it easier for it to climb out. The herd did absolutely everything they could to save the baby elephant from its unfortunate predicament, but their efforts were in vain. They couldn't get the baby out, and it was still stuck in the water. Meanwhile, the rangers at the park got word of the ordeal and came to the rescue with a big back home. At first, they wanted to use the equipment to break down the mud wall so that baby could climb out by itself. It would have taken maybe five to 10 minutes to rescue the small animal, but the adult elephants weren't having any of it. In fact, they got very upset at the sight of the heavy machinery and then the herd did something unexpected. They pushed the baby elephant even further away from the dam trying to protect the calf from the back hole. They clearly felt threatened by the big machine. The reaction is totally understandable. The adult elephants just didn't understand what the rangers were trying to do. However, in their instinctual efforts to protect the baby, this meant the baby was still in danger of drowning and fighting for its life. Time was ticking away. The rangers had no choice but to abandon their initial plan. They were not going to be able to get the baby out with all these agitated adult elephants around. And so right away, they came up with a new plan. The adult elephants had to be moved from the scene as they would only get in the way of the rescue, but they had to act fast. A group of rangers jumped in a vehicle and drove towards the bigger elephants to scare them off. They were making loud noises to chase away the herd from the place. When the adult elephants were at a safe distance from where the baby elephant was stuck, two rangers immediately jumped off the truck and ran as quickly as they could the helpless calf. They had to hurry every minute was one they could not spare. They got to the calf and jumped into the water straight away. They cradled the baby with their hands and with all their strength they pushed and pushed and pushed some more, trying very hard to get the animal and dry ground. And even though it was just a young elephant, it surely took the effort of more than one ranger to lift up the small but heavy calf out of the water. For reference, it's good to know that on average newborn elephant calves stand about 3 feet high and weigh about 264 pounds at birth. Keeping that in mind, you can imagine that the rescue was not as easy as it seems on the photo. The ranger in the water pushed the baby upwards as the other rangers assisted him. They worked with all of their might to rescue the elephant. It took a push here, a shove there, and a lot of willpower and dedication to save the little guy. The rangers didn't stop but literally pushed through. When the baby elephant was finally rescued and had its feet back on dry land, the rangers hurried back to the vehicle. The little elephant, however, had gotten disoriented because of the bushes at the dam. The baby elephant was not able to see its herd or its mother and then started to chase after the vehicle. The rangers were not quite done with the rescue operation. They had to reunite the scared little elephant with mother. So they came up with another plan. They did some more heavy lifting and loaded up the baby elephant in their truck. Next, they drove toward the warty elephant mother to give back her baby. When they let the baby off the truck, the poor guy once again tried to run after its human rescuers. But this time his mom was nearby and saw the calf. So, she swiftly stepped in to make sure the baby saw her as well. The baby elephant and its mom were finally back together again and went off to rejoin their herd. The amazing rescue was photographed by a photographer by the name of Corny Kotze. He happened to be on site and witnessed the whole dramatic scene, which, by the way, lasted for over three hours. It took some time and a lot of effort from the rangers, but thankfully, the rescue had a happy ending. Let's hope this unruly little elephant doesn't get into any more trouble in the near future. Which of these elephant rescue stories has touched you the most? Tell me in the comments and thank you for watching. If you like these stories, please give us thumbs up and consider it to share it with your friends and family. Thank you.